Erlington Secondary School and Institute for Academic and Sporting Excellence this week unveiled a special memorial site on the school property. This special function was held to pay tribute to friends, teachers and well-wishers who have been lost along the way since the school was first established. Former teacher at the school, Prem Vayapuri, shared his sentiments on the function. This entire project started some months ago when one of our uh, ex-athletes, the top four immediately, the national champion Eugene Enoch Dharmalingam, he approached me and asked me if I wanted to get involved with the you know, projects of the school. And I was quite eager because at that stage, and even up to now, I'm still involved with certain projects after I retired with Ellington Secondary School. A number of our learners, our educators, and our uh, support service, the people that work here with us, many of them had passed on. And that is when Eugene started to chat through the chat group, and everyone was quite eager to start a memorial wall with all the names of the people who have passed on, etc. And that eventually gave birth to these, this memorial that we're having here today. And uh, it is the work of the ex-students of the 80s and the 90s. Mala Govinda, one of the event organizers, elaborated on how the event was thought of after initially planning a reunion for ex-pupils from the 80s and 90s. The project was initiated by um, Eugene and myself. Um, it was around the reunion that we were having for our ex-students of the 90, 80s and 90s. Um, after we got into discussions about the reunion, we found that there was a lot of youth, um, sorry, a lot of students, ex-students and teachers that had passed on. So we decided to have a memorial to honor them and you know just to remember them by right? because they also contributed to the school. Um, one thing led to another. We thought it was going to be something small, but it, you know, it became such a, a mammoth task um, because we had to get information on all these uh, people that have deceased, um, get in contact with the next of kin to verify the information, and it's been an all three-month uh, drawn-out process, um, you know, where we had to verify information and get gather the information. And we decided then to also have a like a whole memorial function and unveiling. So we have a wall, a memorial wall. We will put up the names of our late colleagues. And so today, that is what we are. Well, it's all about the unveiling of the memorial wall. The site now affords family and loved ones the opportunity to relive fond memories with those who were part of the school environment in one way or the other. This news broadcast was brought to you by the Rising Sun Digital Team.